I am proud to announce that this year's Heisman Trophy winner is Baker Mayfield of the University of Oklahoma. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Coach, good to see you. Appreciate you guys. This is unbelievable for me, you know, being up here among these greats. Uh, it's something that words can't even describe uh, unless it's them. I mean, God has put me in a position to uh, have been so blessed. And uh, a lot of the time, uh, I wonder why, but it's, it's such an honor. And to be up here, I uh, really appreciate it. It's, it's unbelievable. Um, so, one, first, I'd like to say congratulations to Bryce. Good season, man. I mean, heck of a year. I mean, you played well. I mean, so, yeah. And then getting to know your family as well. A heck of a family. No wonder you turned out great, man. So, congratulations. Keep balling. And then Lamar, good to see you again, man. No, no, no. And, you know, I love your family. I mean, you guys are special people. So, I uh, enjoyed being around you guys. It's Coach Stoops. Uh, you welcomed a, a chubby, unathletic kid into the program with open arms. I wouldn't say that many would do that, but thank you. Uh, but the thing that uh, I'm most thankful for is hiring Coach Riley. The, the day that you did that changed my life, so appreciate that. Uh, Coach Riley, you've been a great mentor to me. Uh, been through a lot together, so appreciate you. Um, to my family, love you guys. There were times uh, that I had to move. You guys made sacrifice after sacrifice just so I could chase my dreams. Wouldn't be here without you. Love you. <clears throat> like I said, sacrifice after sacrifice, you guys have instilled a a mentality in me of loyalty and, and how, to, how to have a family that's second to none. And I appreciate that. Uh, and then to all the Sooner fans back home, uh, and, and including Billy up here too. There he is. Yeah. Uh, it, it's been a dream come true to, to play at OU. <laughs> uh, you know, I, although I grew up in Austin, Texas, Ricky, uh, you know, I was always Sooner born and Sooner bred. And you know, they say, when I die, I'll be sooner dead, and I, I truly mean that. It's been a dream for me, and uh, it's an honor to get to represent my school. Uh, there's, there's many more people I could thank that have helped me get here, uh, but it's, it's unbelievable. I just want everybody to know uh, I appreciate them. I can't name everybody because it's too many. It wasn't just me, and although that statue right there is going to have my name on it, it's, it's more deserving to my team, too, and my coaches. So appreciate you guys. Uh, you know what, and to the kids out there, don't give up. Don't ever give up. Devontae, congratulations. The feel of this is a little bit different, but we'd like to invite you to pick up that beautiful 25-pound Heisman Trophy, which is very near you. Get the feel of it for the first time, and then the floor is yours for your remarks. In the 28-year drought between wide receiving winners of the Heisman Trophy, from Desmond Howard to Devontae Smith. <laughs> Um, you know, this will be possible. Um, congratulate all the finalists just to be in this situation with you guys. Y'all are great athletes. And just to be a part of something like this is truly a blessing. Um, I want to thank my family, my mom, my dad, just everything that y'all taught me to mold me into the young man I am today. Um, I want to thank my mentor, Vincent Sanders. Without you, I wouldn't be where I am today. Just from the rise to taking me places that I want to visit, just to doing things, and just helping me get to where I am. I want to thank Coach Saban for giving me the opportunity to come play at the University of Alabama. Uh, thank Coach Wiggins, my receiver coach, just for helping me day in and day out, watching film, making me a better player. Thank my teammates. Um, with team success comes individual success, so without y'all, I wouldn't be where I am today winning this award. And just to all the young kids out there that's not the biggest, not the strongest, just keep pushing because 
I'm not the biggest. I've been doubted a lot just because of my size. And really, it just comes down to you put your mind to it, you can do it. No job is too big. If you put your mind to it, you can do it and just keep believing in God and you'll get where you want to be. I would like to thank Jeff Allen and the athletic training staff here for giving me all the resources to continue playing this game, to keep me healthy so I can go out there and do the things that I, that I like to do. Thank our president, Dr. Bell, and our athletic director, Mr. Burns, just for being here and making everything possible with COVID going on and giving us a chance to play this season. Thank you. Roll Tide. Camacho, thank you very much. They are thrilled in Amy, Louisiana. They've been nervous, no doubt, for the last hour at the watch party, but they got the announcement that they wanted to hear. I, I want the winner is Lamar Jackson of University of Louisville. Sorry, y'all. This crazy right now for me, man. Oh, snap. I'm shaking right now. I got to get my speech up. I'm sorry. Yeah. Um, first and foremost, though, before I want to, um, before I, you know, go further along with my speech, I want to thank my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, you know. Without him, none of us would be here right now tonight. Um, to the Heisman voters, I'm truly honored and humbled to be a 2016 Heisman Trophy winner. To be able to stand up here like the, all the other former um, Heisman Trophy winners. I'm extremely proud to represent this class and the University of Louisville with their first Heisman Trophy. I'd like to extend my appreciation to the Heisman Trust and all the people this tremendous, oh my God. This tremendous award for making this an experience of a lifetime, and I remember for the rest of my life. For my teammates, this award for all of us. Can't wait to cherish this moment with all of you. And I love you guys. But to be included, I love Didi, man. I love Bake. I just met you guys, but I love them, man. It's Sean and Jabril. You know, it's been a fun experience up here in New York with these guys. And my first time meeting them, man, they treated me just like family. So I love them guys. Oh, <laughs> Growing up in Florida, there were so many influential people in my life who made me the player and the man I am today. To share this award forever. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> Oh, man. It means a lot, man. man. But hold on, I got to go back. <laughs> Two years ago, I had many choices. Throughout the process, there was one school who stood by my side. And that place I fell in love with immediately. And that, that's the University of Louisville. They helped me make the greatest decision of my life. <sighs> it's crazy, man. <laughs> to our athletic director, Mr. Tom Jurich and Mrs. Jurich. They believed in me right away when I came to the university. And I thank you guys. To Coach Peanut sitting right here. The guy who got his head down and won't cry. It's all right, Coach Peanut, man. He put so much in me, you know, growing up. My mom, you know, a single parent. He always believed in me. And the times I didn't want to do it, you know, he'll curse me out. You don't want to be here, go home, stuff like that, you know, the, the usual. But he always stuck with me, and I appreciate that. My coach sitting right next beside him, Bob Petrino. He came to my house on a, um, a home visit. He told my mother, he'll give me an opportunity as long as I'm ready to play. And I love you, coach. To my mother, 
Oh my God. <laughs> I'm just happy to be here. I'm sorry, man. Hey. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. I wasn't nervous at first, you guys, because I didn't know who was going to win this award. But to be up here is crazy, man. These guys are great, and I'm just happy right now. But back to my mother, man. She, she put so much into me, like I said before, you know, losing my father and my grandma on the same day. It hurt me. I wanted to cry real bad, but my mom was a real soldier because I was going to be the, the baby, the female that day. But she told me, she said, Lamar, do not cry. I remember that for the rest of my life. So every time when certain things don't go my way or this and that don't happen, I just own up to it and, become, and just be a man about the situation. And mom, I love you so much, boy. <laughs> Damn, it's crazy. Hey. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. Um, I told my teammates I wasn't going to cry, by the way, but, oh, this is crazy right now. <laughs> Brandon Radcliffe and all them guys, they jinxed me. <laughs> um, but also, I want to give thanks to my coach, um, Nick Petrino, our co um, quarterback's coach. He put so much into me. You know, he's a young coach, but he always believed in me. He always tell me, you're going to be great one day. So shout out to Coach Nick Petrino. And to our fans back at home, this one for you guys. You guys always, always believed in us no matter who we faced, no matter what happened, no matter what our record was, even last year, my freshman year. You always believed in me, and I love you guys. Can't wait to cherish it with you. But, whew, I'm so grateful right now and honored to be here. This is a great award that I accomplished, and I thank you guys and the whole voting committee, you know, the Heisman Committee, and go Cards. The winner of the 2014 Heisman Memorial Trophy is Marcus Mariota of the University of Oregon. Thank you. I'm humbled to be standing here today and honored by this award. Thank you, Heisman Trust, for making this night possible. Everything you do has made so many dreams come true. Omari, Melvin, it's been a pleasure to meet you both, and I wish you continued success. This award belongs to my teammates. The amount of hard work and sacrifice that each of them has made has not gone unnoticed. Thank you to the offensive line and their, and their ability to fight through adversity. Thank you to the skilled guys who constantly make my job a lot easier. Thank you to the defense for making our team complete and bailing the offense out of bad situations. And to all my teammates, I love every single one of you, and I'm truly grateful for all the experiences. I hope each of you will take pride and understand that this is your trophy. Coach Helfridge, Coach Frost, and Coach Kelly, thank you for the opportunity. You took a chance on me, and I'm truly grateful. And to the rest of the coaches and teachers throughout my life, Thank you for the countless life lessons that have shaped me into who I am today. To Hawaii Ne, thank you for teaching me humility and respect. <sighs> Two aspects of my life that I will never change. <sighs> so the Polynesian community, I hope and pray that this is only the beginning. Young poly athletes everywhere, <clears throat> you should take this as motivation and dream big and strive for greatness. <clears throat> this is the hardest part. <laughs> Finally, mom, dad, Matt, and the rest of my family, thank you. <clears throat> thank you for sacrificing <clears throat> and providing me and Matt every opportunity we could ever have. Words can express how much you guys mean to me. I'm truly grateful to have you guys in my life. Mom and Dad, <laughs> thank you for your love and, and sharing that with me and Matt. We're truly grateful. 
Far Fates High Tele Lava. God bless and go Ducks. And we'll go to Joe Tessator with some details on this year's voting. Tess? Chris, what an impressive acceptance speech. The 2018 Heisman Trophy is awarded to Kyla Murray of Oklahoma <laughs> University. This is crazy. Uh, you know, I've worked my whole life um, to fulfill my goals, and you know, uh, but but at the same time, man, I know uh, there's a higher power looking down on me. Uh, he enables me to do all things, um, and you know, for that, I'm grateful for the many blessings that uh, God has blessed me with. And I also, uh, and I want to, I want to congratulate my boys here too, and uh, Dwayne for, you know, their their two historic seasons. Um, it's been an honor to be with you guys the past two days and meet y'all. Uh, be with y'all's families, and I just want to say congratulations to y'all. Uh, <laughs> uh, I want to say to Coach Stoops, um, you and your family have been nothing but supportive to me uh, since the day I stepped foot on campus. Um, I want to say thank you for, you know, just giving me the opportunity to be part of such a historic program and great, uh, great university. Um, it's Coach Riley. Yeah. Uh, man, nobody, uh, nobody really knows how hard uh, these past couple of years have been for me. Uh, but you and my family, and you know, you, through it all, you you pushed me, uh, you, you kept me going, you kept me focused. Uh, you know. And, uh, <laughs> You pushed me harder than any coach ever has, and I just want to say thank you for, uh, you know, believing in me uh, and allowing me to be the quarterback of this team and the leader of this team. So thank you, coach. Um, to my boys um, back home, uh, my linemen, uh, Bobby Evans, uh, Bennett Powers, Creed Humphrey, and Drew Samia, and Cody Ford. Uh, man, you, you guys keep me upright. You keep me safe. Uh, you, you may hurt my pockets on Wednesday at Tea Cafe, but. Uh, I, I, I'd run through a wall for you boys, man. I love y'all. Um, to my playmakers, my receivers, um, running backs, you, know, you, you guys, you make me look so much better than I am. Uh, you, know, you go to battle for me every Saturday, and I, I, I can't ask for much more. So I just want to thank you, uh, thank each and every single one of you guys. Uh, lastly, man, to, my, to my, my parents, my family, uh, my dad, I, I think it goes without saying that you know, you're, you're a legend to me. Uh, you taught me everything that I know about this game. And I honestly feel like you should be up here with me because you know, I really wouldn't be up here if it weren't for you um, introducing me to this game. So thank you, and I love you. Um, to my mom, my best friend, man, <laughs> I, yeah, I, I could be up here all day talking about you. But um, you know, for me, it's, I'm just thankful that you're my mother, and I love you. Um, to, to, my, to my uncle, my godfather, uh, Uncle Calvin and Marky J, uh, and you know, I. I can't explain how much y'all mean to me. Uh, you know, y'all have been with me every step of the way. No matter what it was, you know, I could go to y'all in times of need. And I just want to say I love you and thank you. To my family back home, my brothers and sister, um, you mean the world to me. And, you know, you've, your, your love and support, um, you know, it, it means everything. It means the world to me, so thank you. Um, and I, I just need to reiterate that, you know, I know this is, a, this is an individual award, but I wouldn't be here if it weren't, weren't for my teammates, uh, my family coaches and, and, and Sooner Nation. So uh, to everybody, I want to say thank you and Boomer. Oklahoma. Oklahoma has a seventh Heisman Trophy winner. That draws even with Ohio State and Notre Dame. Weighs about 65 pounds. Put your core into it, but give it a lift. Yeah. <laughs>